executive. We'll take it from here. I am the corporate executive, I thought. You're executive zero one, one, my name. Right then, so this is raw data. What we got to do is more wave based combat. Any minute now. Oh, shut up. Oh, you're talking about them, sure. Yeah, so this is kind of like the most popular game for VR right now. Um, more wave based combat, like I said, but it's very fucking well done. I'm only on like update 0.2, I think, is what I'm playing right now. Uh, yeah, you're not doing a whole good job keeping the security down. Uh, he's getting closer. Oh, this isn't going to go well. Yeah, he's about to break in. Uh, should probably pull out my sword now. Oh, good. It's out of time. Yes. We got ourselves a bloody lightsaber. Look at that. Now, here, the thing is, is that this game actually used to have a different look to it. It used to be like a metal sword that still came out, came out like this. It wasn't all energy before. It just had a glowing edge. I actually like the old design more. I don't like the, ed the all energy effect here. But yes, this is basically a lightsaber. And Glenn, the fact you can do this. Oh, yeah. I forgot about him. All right. Yeah, actually, we should probably do something about this. Do you really need to do the creepy head thing? Oh, well, too bad. Yeah, they're, yeah, those guys are kind of pushovers. Uh, let's just go over here. I gotta be careful about warping over to that door because it sometimes I go through it. There's a space back there that you can go into that you're not supposed to, and it you get stuck in it. Fuck, he flew. Yeah, these guys are kind of the basic enemy. You can teleport directly into them. You have a sense. You now have presence. You didn't always. Yeah, you can turn into starts as well. You have to unlock all these. Oh, hey, need a hand there? It does follow your hand, as you can see there. Really cool effect. Uh, I don't like this sword as much as I like the other guy. We're gonna use him later. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, the Felix head didn't something screws up. Yeah, they make sound after they're dead. That throws me off constantly. They got both? Oh, cool. Yeah, you can, you can block lasers, too. It is basically the lightsaber. There's actually been a couple of lightsaber games right now. The lightsaber, the sword, unfortunately, actually feels quite weak as a melee weapon, because, I mean, yeah. That's awesome. You either really feel like you're beating them with a stick, or you're just kind of like no clipping it through them. It doesn't feel dangerous. Uh, kind of. <laughs> uh, he's uh, this, this is new. They're they're not, they're not weren't always invisible, but he's also supposed to be holding a sword. The fact that makes sound when they're dead throws me off constantly. Where did you get the gun? This is not a gun. Very impressive. Good. Yes, but it's not a gun. Let's go back here. Yeah, this side. This door opens. That one has something behind it, but they never open it in the game. Oh, that's right, the drones come up next. These guys are a bit more of a pain in the ass when you've got the sword guy. Oh, for fuck's sakes. There we go. Ooh, that was close. That was even closer. Come on. Fuck's sakes. Ugh. Good thing I got some range attack with that. You don't unlock those uh, shurikens until later. Yeah, and then the, these guys are a pain in the ass with the sword guy, too. Oh, don't go on the fire. Okay, rapidly everything on fire. Oh, that's really close. Uh oh. Gotta get some practice on the sword. You're a fucking robot. Yeah, he's a comedy sidekick. His stick is that we hacked him to help us out. He's actually supposed to be like a tour guide for the company or something. Oh, here we am on arm. Psych! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, one of them's got their legs. That's a bit of a spoiler. Those guys show up dedica dedicated enemies later. Is he dead yet? Oh, come on. Are they not dead? Go away. I think that covers him. Uh oh. Oh, I hit him. Sweet. You can do this. Oh, fuck. There's a rope. There's a... We got him. <laughs> yeah, one of the rocket guys is in here. Alright, let's get over to him. Where is he? There he is. Ow. Let's get away from the fire. Stamina on this thing. Will you get away from this fucking box? Yeah, wiggle wiggle. <laughs> uh, you just kind of set yourself on fire there, champ. That coming toward me? Yes. I really don't like this teleporting system myself. I actually much prefer... Uh oh. I actually much, much prefer the, the Windland way of doing things. Come on, hit the fucking... Ow! Drones. Fuck sakes. Okay, now they're all firing. Okay, that was kind of cool. I don't think I caught that on the screen though. Good luck looking at them from the side of my view. I'm just gonna go over here. We're not gonna... Uh-oh. Ah, oh, I'm stuck in the spot. Get away from me. Now, there is multiplayer for this game, but I haven't played it yet. I've only been playing by myself. Oh, shit. When did you come in here? Yeah, I totally forgot about these side doors. They open up and spill even more enemies into the level. Joy to the world. Oh, there's more of them over there. Good. They came from both sides. He just went over to the desk. That's cheating. Oh, there's a timer. Shit. Forgot about that. Where? You're lying to me. One left. And he's... For fuck's sake. 
Yeah, yeah the drones are phenomenally dumb. Uh, less of a problem when you have the gun guys, which we're going to be using from here on in. What do I get? There's 98 enemies on that level? Really? Why are there not 100? Exactly. This one, for some reason, takes a while to load up. I don't understand why. Alright, now we're the gun guy. Like I said, I really prefer the pistol guy over the, uh, the sword guy. He's a uh, sword guy, like, it just seems like it's not quite there yet. Okay, so here's the big difference that this is the worst thing in this game by far, in my opinion, is that thing. <sighs> cool. Um, this is a tower defense game from here on out. Uh, they introduced this in this level. Okay. Let's get that extractor started. Now, let's well then. This is the most annoying thing in this game. You have to defend this thing, and it's absurdly fragile. They don't introduce Come this on, mechanic on until the next level, level three. So, what are it's... you waiting for? Shut the fuck up, Jesus. Um, they don't introduce turrets until level three. So, for one level, you gotta defend this thing all by yourself, and it's ridiculously Wait, fucking tedious. Yeah, yeah, shut the fuck up, Jesus. So. That is by far, I don't think that makes the game more fun. It makes the game harder, but it doesn't make it more fun. It's kind of, it's kind of annoying. I'm gonna go over here. So, until you get the turrets, it's pain in the ass dealing with this thing. Once you do get the turrets, it's still a tower defense game, and I'm just not a fan of that myself. I think the game would be more fun if it was more like level two, or level one, where you're just defending more stuff. Flashlight now, please, flashlight. Flashlight should be on by now. There, thank you. Why is that? Why do you have control over that? Surely the flashlight like, doesn't have an on stick. There you go. Somebody down here is making sound, like I said, that throws me off every time. Alright, everything is pretty much normal from here on out. People had a lot of complaints about the level, because they originally didn't give you the flashlight. It doesn't really help that much in my opinion, because every else is glow and their eyes glow. So with him, one, one hit to the face will kill each of these, these guys. I forgot to put another turret down, I probably should have. Speaking of which, that's what they would look, look like they would find. Yeah, as you can see, they'll just shoot at targets in the You turret shot with him as well, which is very important to know for one of the guys that come up later. Oh, these guys, shit. Yeah, they explode. They're the worst thing about this level before you get the turret. Yeah, they're approaching that thing, and they take like a fucking quarter of the damage off that they make it, and you get a lot of... Oh, hello. What's this all about? Hey, I got two. I already have two, but yeah, when you first start this game, you play it a little differently. I don't understand that second pistol thing in general. Yeah, the gameplay changes considerably as you play this game. I had already unlocked the second pistol from my hip. I was already able to, as you can see, I don't know if you can see that. There's already a pistol down there. Um, I haven't pulled it out yet. It's supposed to be because that sometimes just shows up, and I don't understand why. It's unique to this level. I've only ever seen that weapon show up once. And now I got the two of them out. I technically now have three because I still have my holster second pistol. Yes, Simon. Actually, I wonder what happens if I try to use this to pick up that thing. Can I drop it? All right. So, all right. I'm just gonna use my own. I don't like it. Oh my god, this is gonna be the coolest thing. <laughs> oh you can do that. I wonder if the ninja guy can grab that sword, that gun. I should try that. Oh yeah, that's right. Same thing. The door opens. Oh shit, not that. When you first start this game, you gotta reload your gun manually by grabbing ammo from that side and manually feeding into the gun on your, in your dominant hand. Same point to unlock the second pistol, you can... That's, it turns into another pistol, right? Uh, before you get that, though, get rid of these guys here. You just prop your, hip, your gun to your head. That's the best, the best upgrade by far. You gotta use turn shots on these guys. That gun's gun, I didn't notice that. I think they come from up here next. Let's actually turn on bullet storm. It only lasts like two seconds. I only really try to use the drones. The um fucking hell, all the bullet cartridges I left behind. The spam works will whop out with two pistols, but you only get the one and you're feeding it in like that. It's nowhere near as effective because you only got 15 to a magazine, right? That sucks. Whereas I hey, I get second him really quick. He clips into the floor. I just want to point that out. Shit, I forgot to put the turret down. Put the turret down now. Come on, place it, place it, place it. It takes longer in-game compared to when you're between phases. When you're in a phase, it takes like three minutes long. There you go. Get them on, mate. Get them on. They're not hitting anything from behind that barrier. Oh, fuck. I just got hit by a bomb guy. That's another easy way to get rid of them. Let's get really close to them. There's a bomb guy over there. You can see his corpse there. That's off. That's not some shit. Come on. Whoa. Thought I heard something. Whew. That gets a little hectic from the level onward. 
Okay, let's actually put the defenses up currently, correctly. And we're gonna put one down right in front of it. There you go. When you're in this mode, it builds a lot faster than when I was in actual mode. Riveting dialogue. I think she's wrong. I think it's Rockets next. Yeah, give her a second. I think she, um, her dialogue is usually quite inaccurate. Watch out for Rockets! Yeah, there you go. She said something about having using your sword if you're holding the gun and using your gun if you got the sword. Yeah, do what he said. It'd be okay in the ass for the knife guy. Oh, fuck. Hey, he went back into it. Oh, anyway, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. A little fun of my dirt. I hate these not zombie ones. They're not that dangerous, but there's lots of them. Shitloads of these guys come in. Oh, fuck. I always forget to put the inside doors. Time dilation. Time warp. I haven't used that ability in a lot, but it's very, very useful. I swear I hear something behind me. Oh well. How many more are there? There you go. One. <laughs> Can I answer that question? Oh! Behind me. Can I have the... Thank you. You're doing better there, pal? This is level three. This is one of the... It's either this one or the second one that they're complaining about. So, this is actually where they introduce the turrets, but I didn't know how to do this the first time I played this level, because it does not tell you. This game tells you quite thoroughly how to do some stuff, but some... Shut up already. Get placed down, will you please? There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna put that one there for no reason, just facing the wall. Um, but yeah, I didn't tell me how to put the fucking turret down. Let's just do this to shut those two up already. So, the first time I beat this, I did it with just the pistol and the one pistol. Like, I didn't have the fast reload, speaking of which, I didn't have the fast reloading, I didn't have the second pistol here, none of that. I mean, I did it with just the one pistol. And I barely managed it. That thing, I only had like three health left. So I'm gonna go down here. This level introduces two new enemies, not the least of which are, these guys are kind of, you know, you know these guys, save them before. This level, in my opinion, is actually quite a bit easier, even without the turrets, than the previous one, because the first time you do the previous one, you are massively, massively, massively underqualified to do it. And here they come, the new assholes. They're like the blue guys, but these guys run. At point, there's more coming from over there, so I'm keeping an eye over there. Yeah, it's spam works a hell of a lot better on these guys. They keep them back. Come on, die. Thank you. Is he dead? Oh, uh, more coming. Yeah, we're not done yet. Oh, more. There's a combination of slow and fast guys coming now, so I'm actually going to go over here and... Get rid of them. I'm gonna keep the runners are coming from over there too. Yeah, just we need more time. kill them. Alright. Alternate one and the other. The other two turrets are gonna be going there. Perfect. Maximum of three turrets, by the way. I haven't started the fourth level yet. Once I beat the third one, I went back and unlocked as much tech as I could. Oh, shit. This is the... Get back on the platform. Get back on the platform. Forgot about this one. Shit, load the drone. Gotta get him. I find this is better than bullets normally. You might as well use it. I have a very hard time aiming the bullet storm. I find it easier to aim just the manual rapid fire because I can actually see where the bullets are going. When you do the uh, bullet storm, you really don't see anything outside of your own flat. Fuck. Uh, don't shoot me, a dick. Fortunately, your turret cannot hurt you. You can, however, block their view. And you can also knock these guys out of the flat, which is already useful. The other new enemy should be coming around this round, I believe. Kill them when you see them. What are you shooting at? Yep, there he is. Oh, here he comes. There's another one somewhere. Those guys usually come in pairs. They might, the first one might be one alone. Getting him? Got him in the head. Perfect. Keep him back. Keep him back. Are you gonna kill him? Why do you need to go over there? Oh, fuck. Bomb guys. Should be. Oh, they're coming up there now. Good. I know for a fact the, the big punchy dude's coming somewhere. So are the zombies. There you Okay. Big punchy dudes. Two of them. Should be two of them. Where's the other one? Fuck, he turned and hit me. These guys are a lot harder when you only got the one pistol, let me tell you. There he is. Please don't kill me. Hey, <laughs> landed on my turret. Are we not done? What's left on this round? I can't remember. I'm not putting these down. Are you dead? <laughs> no, that was the reason. There was a guy, he, he had no arm or leg, he couldn't come over. Oh wow, that was almost good time. It's a great thing she does. Really? He took no he must have taken damage. That guy got screwed over by the um, shooter bot. Yeah, the part of the reason I was able to beat this without the turret the turret wasn't that good. But they they're a distraction. They give they give the guy something other to punch something to, to attack other than you and the very fragile data center thing. Oh fuck off. This is the one where a shitload of these guys come in. I'm actually gonna do this. Slow in time. They have a lot more effective than the bullets. 
Real loud, please. Thank you. No, no. No, you're there. There's a lot of bloody bullets. I think that's all of them. Oh, fuck. We missed one. There we got them. How are you in health? You're fine. Looks like the large ship More of these guys. The Why are they keeping shipments of the dead dudes? Who's next? Where? Oh, the rocket guys are next. That's right. Third one. Uh, the other one might be on the other side. Fuck. They don't, they, said they don't always come from opposite sides. Is it the over here? Yes. It takes them longer to come from this side than the other side. So that's why I do it from this way. I knocked them down. That'll do. Uh oh. Ooh, that is a lot. I'm just gonna go over right here and... Gotcha. Registration errors on the controllers, like always. Hasta la vista. Oh, whoops. Oh, they're fine. What? That was out of the blue. Oh, good. Oh, joy. Punchy dudes and runny dudes. A winning combination, and I don't see the other one. It's coming from the other side. What's coming from that side? He's already up here. Oh, fuck me. Fuck, he's right on top of that turret already. And now these guys are all on top of me now. Fuck, Jesus. That was a mess. Are you okay? Well, I'm almost dead. Uh, I'm just gonna prepare him. This is why you want two pistol, baby. How are you guys? You're fine. Oh, good. More of this. Oh, yeah. These guys come with bomb dudes. They're actually quite useful. Just gonna slow you down here. Let the bomb guys catch up. Got him. One of the later characters are gonna add is gonna use a fucking bow and arrow. How the hell is that gonna work? What are you shooting at? Oh, you missed one. Okay. Why do they build a robot that does nothing other than explode? Oh, fuck. That's right. Rifle dude and lots of them. I think this is the finale, too. You gotta get the rifle guys down because a lot of them are coming from that side. Come on, fall down. Thank you. What's left over this side? Whoa! Nice job. We did it. Dick move, buddy. Dick fucking move. <laughs> you don't need me anymore, right? No, I've never needed need you. you. Jesus. All right. Unlike the previous couple of levels, um, I've never done this one before, and I am not using anything I don't already have unlocked. All right, so it looks similar to the previous one, like the same as level one was to level two. Oh, fuck, this is big. Jesus, this is way bigger. Oh, wow, there's like, is that eating up? No, it's not just like the last one. This is like way bigger. Okay, this is go ahead and attach the extractor. new. Uh, not quite yet, ma'am. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, tear it up my... All right, this is new and interesting. All right, this right, I'm probably going to lose horribly here. There's a lot of turf to cover with uh, just myself and one turret to help me out. Wish me luck. Are you supposed to be surprised? I'm assuming, I'm hoping they only offer come from this side or from this, this direction. They come from behind, I am in trouble. All right, our appetizer today is shit lots of rifles and more than I think the entire first level. All right, this is going to be interesting. Be a lot. I actually tried to put my foot down on the step that's not there in real life. Above you. I see them. Oh good, I can actually hit them from here. Not like the Chirukins that have piss range. Oh, this is a lot of potential gunfire coming up. I gotta keep them on the platform. Oh, that's a lot of gunfire. That is a pissing load of gunfire. Oh, Jesus. What are you shooting at? Stop shooting at the... Part of the reason I put the character is so they can shoot at something other than the actual thing itself. Do I have another turret? Yes. Alright, so I don't have enough for three turrets, so we'll just go along. Okay, so even though there's tons of territory, I can defend it from just this platform for now. I'm terrified of what's going to happen with later levels. I might actually have to force my way down here. Although, at the same time, I've already understand this game scales, so I don't have to worry about that, possibly, because I'm the only person here. Oh, you're going to give me the zombie guys, really? How many fucking guys are coming? If you have a lot of people, let's put, the, uh, put more enemies, and maybe then you got to go down, you have to go down to the ground level. Oh, he flew. Yeah, the physics engine kind of screws up. Alright, let's try. No, you don't! Oh, whoa, it's like right up on me. Oh, that was a lot of, a of lag. Jesus. lag of in this game. This game runs phenomenally well, by the way. I'm only running on 1970. One and recording on 1970. Alright, they're dead. I'm going back up then. What's up here? Got them There's lots of fucking riflemen there. This is a good spot. Setting on this step. Because they. Those stairs are farther away from the to, from the actual thing, so I don't. I can have a bit of an easier time here. I'm worried if I don't if I don't watch this one in particular, they're gonna get right up next to it, and I won't even notice. We're gonna put the third one. I'm finding this is the. Are you gonna? What's your problem? What are you fucking playing? Very good, Simon. Let's move. This conversation you two are having is really stupid. When I can only hear you, not him. It's getting foggy, or is it just me? 
Alright, fine, just fucking asking. Jesus. Yeah, no, it is definitely getting flat here. There's a lot of fucking gun guys. Oh shit, no, you should get the ground. Sure. What happened to you two? Did I cut your feet off from a distance? Oh, bomb gun. Sure. Joy to the world. Oh, he didn't die. Fall down, thank you. There's a lot of them, holy shit. The best thing about I am getting more lag in the hand now that's more. I think the fog is what's doing me in. Um the best thing about the bomb guys is that they cluster up, you only have to kill one, and it'll take the rest out with them. Keep shooting. Let's keep shooting. I have no fucking idea what I'm shooting at. Oh, the running guy, that's what I'm, that's what's coming. You were saying both around. What's the name? Not doing the thing I did with you. That'll do. Bullshit. Call the bullshit. More bomb guys. I mean probably more coming from the other side too. Still pretty good though, so far anyway. What the fuck happened there? Oh hey. There you go. The fog is definitely uh, causing some lag. When the explosions go off, it did not mix. That didn't kill you, really? Oh my god. That's off. Thank you. I gotta be careful they don't go from this side. Oh, yep. Yeah, right there. Oh, the rocket guys, huh? Turn sideways. Let's... Oh, he's over there. He's in the middle. Shit. Ooh, that leg. That... I missed one. I think he's over there. Hard to see him. I hit him in the leg. That'll do. Blow up. Took your buddy out with you. There you go. Fortunately, thank fucking god, they don't crawl like the uh, zombie ones. Or that would just be an anchor. That'd be way too hard. These guys are not that hard for the gun dude. They're more of a trouble for the robot guy. For the ninja guy. Can't see a thing. I killed one. Oh, yeah. Plenty of bomb guys. More bomb guys, of course. It's really hard. <laughs> it's on one leg. Alright, good. It's really tough um, aiming two guns at different directions at the same time. That akimbo shit is ever the most. Not a dent. Perfect. Can I play more cards? No. That's coming. Oh, him. Uh oh. Oh, there's like three of them coming. Is that a rocket, man? Come on, fall down. Those guys are laborious more than anything else. Are you coming from this side? Yeah. Just sneak around me, you cheeky fucker. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, no, they're all dead. I see something spawning in the middle. I'm bitten something, I don't know what it is. Can I get a better idea? Oh, did it? Regular dudes? Sure, why not? Just regular guys. Zombies, I see that one. I don't know if it actually spawns on me if I just happen to cut one off on the way. Yeah, so far in this game, trying to be level 2 the first time before you get all these awesome upgrades is the hardest part of the game, by far. Don't pull the rockets out, don't. There you go. No, we're not done yet. Something coming from over here? Yes, yeah, more of them. Holy shit. Yeah, this must be impossible for the ninja guy. Unless there's something about these guys I don't know about with ninjas. There you go. Am I missing anything over here? Jesus! You didn't hit the fucking thing, did you? No. Yes, he did. What? Why are you saying that? What is Eden created? What? Runners. Back to my good spot. There we go. I think I'm, yep. I don't think I hit a thing that time, right, but that's way better than the bullet one. God, really? That was it? Oh, that was easy. That, don't say that in this game. That, you cut yourself off there. No. What? Is, what? Did I grab that by accident? Did I touch that? Oh my god, it started itself. Something's coming. The fog is definitely getting worse. No. It's all or nothing. Did I kill him by accident? What are you fucking... Is he running in slow motion? Fuck, let's go over here. Oh goody, another one. What did I just do? Move, please, move, move, move. This has gone incredibly wrong. They're crawling all over my turrets and my fucking things. Okay, that could have gone worse. Right. That's a lot of these guys. Holy shit. How are you in health? Good. Somehow they did more damage to the thing inside behind them than they did to the turrets, and those are punchy dudes. What is coming? No, really? No, okay, bomb guys, I see them. This is. Ah, the bomb guys are a blessing in this case. Yeah, the bomb guys are very, very. There's something big in the shadow there. I think it's a rocket guy. Doesn't matter now, it's dead. You can do this. Oh, what? What's spawning now? Fuck. I, I'm just shooting wildly. There's gotta be a lot of them up ahead of them doing that. Oh, hey! I missed you. You must have gotten out of the way. Cut this off. Yeah, if I remember, I was like, what's left? There's bomb guys. These, these guys are very... These guys were dangerous in the second level because they, they came from, like, right next to the start of the spot. Like, right next to the uh, data core. Here, they're coming from, like, miles away. They're no problem. By the time they get to me, the, everything else has already come and gone. Like, I've already killed everything else. I don't like the fact that I don't see anything. That's done, I think. Not mission complete, though. What's left? 
One more wave. You better not keep me at your word. If that doesn't, I'm pissed off. Thank you. No, move. Fuck. Oh, I did not mean to go that far. Time for slow-mo. Keep my slow-mo. Why won't my powers not turn on? There we go. The day really loved the point you do for any good combination. I just saw his arm over my shoulder. Why are we on fire? There's a missile guy over there. Three of them. Come on. Come on, line up, because these are piercing shots, so you do go through them. Alright! I beat it on my first fucking try, baby. What's my score? I don't know if that's even good. Aim is 16%. <laughs> yeah, if I have unlimited ammo, who gives a shit? I'm not conserving energy here. Alright, yeah, so that was raw data in its current form. Any come on, thank you, controller. It's got a nice lobby though. I love the view. I love going over here. I love the, I love this view. This very much reminds me of Perfect Dark, where you're playing the first level, the one in Data Dine, when you can see out into this really futuristic city consisting of an infinite supply of flying cars. Don't look too close at the terrain in between the. Um, let me just get something I can point with. Don't look too close in between the um, buildings where the terrain is. It's not that pretty looking. And don't look up at. <laughs> The little, kind of squashed, very clearly 2D moon in the sky up there. But other than that, this is a fantastic view. Very evil. I love it. Actually, I live in a big city, so I would love to live in a place like this. Probably always perpetually dark out, but yeah. I remember when I first I started, I was wondering, hey, what's this guy going to do? I bet he's going to be a tougher version. No, he's just, he is. He's, yeah, the bait of my existence is what he is. I love the little QR codes under chest. Fuck, he's really tall on that platform. But yeah, I love the little QR codes. Let me realize something. That's the ninja guy. These guys only showed up in the first level. In the end, I only saw two of them in the entire game. That was... I'm assuming they're going to put more of them in, the, in later. Yeah, so as it stands, this game does early access right. It's already very well built. Very good mechanics. When I ran run into a couple of glitches, it looks really nice. And it runs very well while looking very nice. That's very important. And Like I said, I'm only using the 1970. All it's missing is content, and that's what EA should be. It should be very well built, but missing in content. And they can work on content once they get the mechanics down right. That's exactly what that should be. So it's worth the money, in my opinion. I personally think the data core takes away from the game. I think it's not as fun as if I was just defending myself, but I don't like tower defense in general. I just kind of see the crate as a basically a static escort mission. It's just not my idea of entertainment. Obviously people will disagree, but personally I want to see this game get more game modes. I want to see it has something other tower defense. I want to see that actually, I want to see a, the ability to move through a level. Because as much as I prefer Windline's way of motion, uh, you can get around with this thing. I would like to actually have a, like almost a Half-Life 2 style way of getting around the level. Like, you know, like a move from A to B, get to the end of the level kind of situation. That would be so fun with this game. It would really, really work. But only time will tell, and the, as it stands now, this is the most popular game in VR as far as I know, and it's well-deserved. Personally, Windlands is my favorite game, but, you know, opinions may differ. And more importantly, is VR has really got to rectify this problem about universal standard motion, because this works for a lot more people than Windlands, but if Windlands, if you can stay, I realize the reflection in the floor... Uh, kind of disappears when I look down. It's a bit of a bug. Windlands, if you don't get sick from it, it's probably way more fun for the people who can do it. But not everybody can do it, and that's not, that's not a trivial problem. We have to get around that in the VR. There's a lot going to be happening in the future, and it's going to be a lot of fun. But until then, see you next time.